Tomorrow marks 22 years since the terrorist attack on September 11th. You're looking live now from the 9-11 Memorial in Lower Manhattan. Tomorrow morning, the annual commemoration ceremony will be held to remember the lives lost. Vice President Kamala Harris will be in attendance as President Biden will be at a military base in Anchorage, Alaska. And a group of veterans gathered at Liberty Park for a 9-11 Memorial Steps event today. Participants walked 2,200 steps to represent the number of stairs first responders had to climb on their way up the 110-story World Trade Center. The event also offers participants who served in the wars that followed a space to reflect around those with shared experiences. What happened here on 9-11 affected all of us as well as veterans, especially those that um, fought in the wars that were, you know, fought because of the events that took place at 9-11. And we came here today to honor the first responders and those that were lost here on 9-11. The event was hosted by TD Bank and Team Red, White and Blue, which is a nonprofit organization that promotes health and wellness for veterans. Also today in Chelsea, firefighters and other community members honored the nearly 3,000 lives lost on September 11th. The group marched the same route that Father Michael Judge took on that tragic day. He was an FDNY chaplain who died in the line of duty during the attacks. This walk of remembrance has become a tradition every Sunday before the 9-11 anniversary. And the September 11th commemoration ceremony begins tomorrow morning at 830. We'll go on the air at 825 in the morning and bring the observances to you live right here on CBS 2.